Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. Today we have a very exciting new wig to try. This is from Sam's Beauty. They sent over their Invisible Lace HD 13x6 Pre-Plucked Human Hair Blend Wig. So this hair features 13x6 lace frontal. The lace is HD, available in brown and neutral HD. It has baby hairs, it has a six inch deep parting space, it's pre-plucked. Um, yeah, the color I have is MO, MOP Blonde. All the details will be linked down below. I have, all I've seen is what this looks like on the mannequin or the stock photo online. And I don't know about y'all, but the wigs always look different in real life. Most of the time they look better in real life. So I cannot wait to try this out and put it on my head. Since I'm on a hair growth journey, I'm all about wigs right now. I feel like wigs are like the number one protective style. I I know people like to say that they rip out your edges and all that stuff, but I don't glue my wigs down. And if I do, it'll be like got to be glue, nothing crazy. I take them off every night, I wash them regularly, I hydrate and moisturize and wash my hair weekly. So I'm taking very good care of my hair and I'm retaining length. My hair density is even from root to tip, so wigs is where it's at. So let's go ahead and put her on. Oh, before I put her on, I wanna show you guys an up close of the lace. So this is brown lace. It's darker than my skin, but my face is darker than the rest of my body. This will most likely go with my face, especially if I have makeup on and I have, you know, contour or bronzer on my forehead. It's gonna be the same, the same color. So inside, one thing I love about human hair blend wigs or beauty supply store wigs is that the wigs are very lightweight. They're super lightweight. And the, I don't know if you guys can see the track layout, but it's so breathable. Like, it's so breathable. Like, you can see my fingers. I love that. Especially with these summer months. Don't nobody want to feel like they got a freaking helmet on their head. So this is nice and lightweight and breathable. I'm trying not to get too excited. I cannot wait to see my husband's reaction to this blonde unit. Okay, I'm gonna just brush it out just a little bit. Just to make sure that it's laying properly. And another thing, like the maintenance is very like, if this was complete like human hair, you'd probably have to go in every day with a flat iron or a curl to touch up the curls, but I don't think I'm gonna have to do that. So let's go ahead and position her. You guys, I don't know about y'all, but I am obsessed with this bang. Oh my god. This this is giving grown woman, honey. This is giving rich auntie. <laughs> okay, so now that I cut the lace, I'm just going to slide the wig back a little bit. And I'm going to go ahead and lay my edges down. I feel like that's going to make the wig look a little bit more natural. So I'm going in with some mousse. And then I'm going with my edge control. You can use whatever edge control works for you. I'm gonna take my same edge control and just tack the, the wig down. 
I got a little bit on my finger. I'm just gonna go over that entire hairline. And while we're at it, I'm going to take a little bit of edges out from the wig itself. And I'm going to do some baby hairs. Okay, you guys, this is the final look. I love this wig. This is going to be one of those date night wigs. I find that it's very sexy and I can turn to an alter ego for my husband. <laughs> Again, everything that you need to know about this wig and how I installed it will be linked down below. Um, this is a human hair blend wig, so when the curls or the bumps start to fade or sag, you can go ahead and hit it with your flat iron at a low heat, which is nice. You can wash this. It, I did not get any tangles while installing it, so that was nice. I didn't have to deal with any funky smells all around. I think I might be adding more human hair blends into my selection. I used to steal my aunt's wigs and wear them to school. That's, that's, let's, let's not talk about that.